Steve here with Table Rock Tea Company. It is a rainy Friday afternoon, one of my favorites, and I'm just spending some time here in the study. It's been a while since I've done a book review, so I'm going to go ahead and do one now. Uh, this is, again, another departure from tea, but it does have to do with the medicinal side of things, especially... Um, I guess, uh, homeopathic or naturopathic medicine. So um, not everything has to be ingested, right? Um, so this book is called Acupressure's Potent Points by Michael Reed Gatch. I'll put the link in the description and comments below as always. And if you uh, use that link, it helps support this channel. Um, I really like this book. Um, I do believe that there is something to acupressure and something to acupuncture, although acupuncture is significantly more advanced. I don't think that's something that uh, most people should do or attempt. Um, and I'm going to give you a little bit of my take on acupressure. Uh, and I don't subscribe to all of the religiosity around it, the spiritualism side of it. I don't believe in chakras or any of that kind of stuff. Uh, but I do believe in neural pathways. I work in surgery. I've been a surgical nurse for the last three decades. And um, yeah, so there's definitely something to be said for how nerves work. Um, we have kind of running uh, jokes uh, in the operating room about um, different kind of naturopathic things because sometimes people can take those things too far. But I do believe that in their proper place, they have a proper place. And so acupressure is one of those things, particularly for different uh, types of pain, headaches in particular, uh, that kind of thing. And what this does is it shows uh, the different pressure points. And so it has different um, diagrams, a lot of pictures, a lot of uh, places and points that you can use to, to pinpoint certain things. Pretty easy to follow uh, for different ailments. Um, but again, I look at it purely in the mechanical, electrical part of pain. So um, I believe that what's happening, and, and again, there are a lot of theories, but I believe what was happening with acupressure is essentially you have different nexus points of nerves that when you push against them and put pressure on them, they will short circuit some of the other signals to your brain. That just seems to make... Uh, good biological sense to me. Um, I, again, I don't read anything uh, amazing or, or weird about it. Um, and how those pathways uh, happen, uh, yeah, it's pretty complex. The, the human body is a pretty amazing uh, piece of engineering. So um, I really do like this book. Again, there's some stuff in there that gets onto the, you know, you can heal this or that through the nerve uh, pathways. Some of it, has legitimacy others of it is probably hocus pocus but i use it mostly for um the actual pinpointing of those nerve centers so to speak and i've used it several times um with good results so uh yeah um as far as the acupuncture goes i think you really need to go to uh, china for that and study under a uh, uh, pretty formal training to really uh, do that right um, but anyway, uh, this is one of those books that, that's a, a good little uh, side note to have in your uh, medicinal arsenal. Again, acupressure's potent points. So check it out on Amazon. And uh, yeah, thanks again for watching. Stay tuned to see what else is brewing here at Table Rock Tea Company.